It's time for us to be consecrated to God and meditate day and night in the Word as Joshua did. We need to spend more time in the good book and less time in the Facebook. You don't have to worry about being banned from the good book like you do Facebook if you did something wrong. There are posts in this book that we need to read again and again and again until we have them memorized the way Joshua had to memorize the book of the law. You might find more posts in Facebook than in this book, but this book has God-inspired posts from Abraham, Jeremiah, Joshua, David, Matthew, Mark, Luke, John, Paul, Peter, James, and more. Inspired. Best of all, this book has posts from Jesus Christ, the only Son of God. And let me tell you, the posts in God's book do not have to be fact-checked or corrected. The post in this book will never be censored and will never be deleted and never be lost. The post in this book never, never, never gets stale. They never get old. They're alive. There are posts in this book that we need to share with everyone we meet and never, ever, ever block anybody from this book. Do you hear me? The good book has life-changing posts full of meaning. The good book posts are encouraging, uplifting, loving, relevant, inspired, positive, convicting, transforming posts, all inspired by the one and only true God. Come on now. Oh, wait a minute, Brother Dennis. You're hitting kind of close to where I live now. Well, yes, I guess I am. Come on now. It's time to put down Facebook and pick up the good book. It's time. We sacrifice time every day. Sacrifice time in the good book for time in Facebook. And it's wrong. It's just wrong. We make Mark Zuckerberg richer and richer every time we open Facebook while we go spiritually bankrupt. Come on now, you know it's right. And it's not just Facebook, but virtually every other social media platform gets rich from our activity on their apps while we suffer spiritual bankruptcy. I'm just telling you what I see, folks, and if it makes you uncomfortable, then there just might be a reason for that. Well, I'll just use Facebook for Messenger anyway. Let me tell you something. The good book has messages from the greatest messenger that ever lived. <laughs>